I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that! Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... Um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! You've been making plans, Max, what the fuck? I don't know, what do you want me to say? I'm sorry, Max. This this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's just... Focus on getting out of here, for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually... Yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal, you remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead... There's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big, like person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, 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 I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, Whoa, look at the moon! It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods, and you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month? Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your- Goddamn mine?
Werewolves? Seriously?